which is basically equivalent to Bitcoin's PE ratio. It suggests right now that we are in deep value opportunity because much of the value driven by this new era of increased Bitcoin on-chain utilization makes the chain, the blockchain, the network much more valuable than ever before. So per this chart, it looks like, let's see if there's a little price here of where we can go. If, if it does, well, there's no, there's no price correlation to it, but basically Bitcoin is in the deep value zone too. And in other news too, Bitcoin energy value is now at 83,000. And this is the intrinsic value of Bitcoin priced in raw jewels of electricity into the mining network only. And this electrical cost suggesting a higher baseline for prices. So we have this Bitcoin energy value. It's currently at 83,000. And it's going to trend into 90 to 100,000 in the coming weeks as a result of the lower annualized supply growth rate of Bitcoin and, of course, the increasing hash rate and everything else. So that could be a new baseline price for Bitcoin, 83 to 100K. And there's a lot of people talking about how that could easily happen. Now, in other adoption news, too, this just came out today. Breaking news from Jack Dorsey. Not only did Jack Dorsey talk about his new three nanometer chip yesterday for Bitcoin mining, but this block, which is used by many, many merchants who sell things, coffee shops and record stores and art on the streets, swipe your phone, boom, basically opens up people to become merchants without all the crazy, hard, difficult credit card stuff that you need to do to get a merchant account. But now what he enables is people can automatically convert up to 10% of what you make selling your wares into Bitcoin. So you sell a hundred bucks, just auto DCA $10 of that into a different currency called Bitcoin. This could be massive for adoption. Massive. One day I'll, I'll tell you all a funny story about this, uh, of how I DCA'd back in the day.